Okay, so this is going to be kind of a unboxing slash review on 100 Unique Fine, li fine Liners by Shuttle Art. Now online, it shows that their colors are very off. <laughs> so I have to make my own color scheme. Mm, they are 0.4 millimeters, so very close in size to the, actually, I don't know the name of the brand. <laughs> so, all right, well, I'm going to open this and show you what's inside. All right, so here's the color scheme that they had made, um, but looking online, they do not match. The markers don't match these colors at all. They are very, very off. But it's okay because they still had a good variety of colors. Look at that. Look how pretty that is. This is the first tray that's on top. And just want to look at one of these so you can see its shape see that and then it has that on the bottom sorry one second so you see its tip and then its body I'm trying to do this with one hand here, hold my phone, ain't working out too well. But y'all can deal with me, bear with me. So that it can just stay on the end like that and you can just, you know, scribble. And no, I'm not left-handed. Okay, I'm gonna show you the other trays now. <clears throat> I wish they would have put them in like, let's see, two, four, like six smaller trays would be easier, but anyway. So you have your browns and all your blues and your purples and you're so pretty. And then moving into the other tray. And then we have more blue, um, green. Not sure what, well, the way how it's coming up on the camera. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. I see. I don't know how to turn on the light. I'm sorry. <laughs> but yeah, that's about it. And uh, I'm going to show you how the color looks with just one pen. I'm going to use this one. Okay, give me one second. So I moved to the kitchen and I have this color it's not showing up too well on camera it's it's actually a light blue let me see if I can get it in the yeah it's, it's just weird but anyway so I'm gonna show you I'm gonna leave this lid here so you can compare the color oh well, I mean, it's not too far off. That's kind of weird. Maybe some of them are close. Maybe some of them aren't. Let me try another color. All right, hello YouTube again. So I just spent a few minutes here testing all the, well, not all the colors, but let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine colors. And they are all, they're, they match the marker um, that's all I really wanted was for it to match the marker I don't know about the color scheme itself this one that they sent me it's okay if it doesn't match that I don't care about that part um, I'm not sure how I'm supposed to find the color on here anyway like maybe this one's supposed to be this one there's supposed to be a bright pink and I'll show you that one. 
so I don't know where on here the bright pink would be um, actually it doesn't this doesn't match any of them so that's not a problem for me because um, I, I wouldn't know how to find it on here anyway I don't really care about knowing the name of the color um, I mean it would be nice but at the same time it's not gonna stop me from thinking of a color I want and you know using it but what does matter is that the this marker the color that they have on the actual marker matches the marker ink so if you do want it to match I'm not sure how you're gonna get the name for that but you can number it how they numbered it but I mean if you guys this is more of a bright pink so you have rose pink and light pink light peach so this bright peach is not a rose pink or a light pink light pink is pretty much like this one so if we put it here sorry I'm not doing this right <laughs> if we put it here for light pink it still doesn't match I want you to see the name of it light pink is right here so maybe they're having a problem with I don't know what happened <laughs> at the factory or whatever wherever they were putting the colors in that they don't match but I'm very satisfied with this because I thought I was gonna have to make my own color chart and at first I didn't want to do that because there's a hundred colors but then I thought okay I'll just number it on the picture and I'll also number it on the marker with the color <clears throat> but since I don't have to take my time doing that then I can just go about my day um, so I got this I got it at the post office I called around 8 a.m. today um, last night I mean they wanted me to wait 12 hours just to get my package so I asked them to put a hold on it and they did and I went and picked it up but yeah just one more last look I can't wait to try these out I will definitely update you and again these colors they look so much better in person I don't know why the camera is picking up the colors like that like right here this one is more of a let's see this is more um, maybe it's like a sea green maybe it could pass for aqua but it looks kind of like a pale dull baby blue on camera but I promise you it looks nothing like this and I wish my camera could pick it up but it's just not maybe it's because my phone is an older phone it's a loner because I broke my other one and without this loner I will be out of a phone for like a good four months so anyway <laughs> thanks for watching the video and I'm going to show you the other tray real fast so I wanted you to see this last tray now this one is pretty bright I think it's doing a good job let's see no it's well it's kind of close to its actual color but not really it still isn't picking it up fully but um maybe with someone else's phone I can show you the results of coloring a picture so I work at a call center and between calls I would like to color pictures and see how long it takes me you know how many work shifts to complete the picture the one that I'm doing now hold on I'll show you in a second so this is a work in progress I just started this one on the, the 22nd and I don't know what today's date is today is the 26th two, three, four, five, six. so actually three days because I don't work today and I told myself I can't do it on work on off days this is just a project for my work days but the one that I really want to do with the markers is this one 
I so as you can see they're very tiny and tedious looking at first I didn't want to do it but then I was like you know what I'm gonna take up that challenge and do it and I know I need patience so the reason why I did the first picture with color pencils is because that's all I had and I just got my 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 beautiful new pen set in the mail today so thanks for watching uh, stay updated with me on this journey of, you know, coloring. <laughs> and thank you for watching.